Gibby Pata, who is there on the scene. And just by the looks of it, there is a lot of damage, Gib. Yeah, Javier and Gina, this is what's left of that uh, Prano Mart out here. Now, you can see the trailer that's behind the Prano Mart. Now, there's actually someone who was staying there, and you'll see here in the video that we had that the, that woman and her two dogs were being assisted by paramedics as uh, they were taking care of her. She is going to be all right. Now, the other fears they had here uh, was that the owner, Moose, who sometimes stays here at the Prano Mart overnight, he um, he was inside this building as it was going up. Well, he's been accounted for and he is OK. But as you mentioned, the roof did collapse and Glendale Fire had to go defensive on this before completely putting it out. They tell us it will be a couple of days before they uh, determine what caused this fire. Now, one other problem they add out here, Gino, was that 59th Avenue was closed from Missouri to Bethany home. That has since been reopened. So if you're getting uh, ready to head out to work and you use 59th, Avenue. Both lanes are now open. Ah, that's some really good news, Gibby. Thank you so much. Uh, especially as folks are getting up this morning. That's a